Hello, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to manage your PHP versions in WAMP. So I'll be showing you how to check the current version of PHP that you're on in WAMP, change the um, current version to another one and add in new versions to WAMP. So let's begin. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to start up WAMP. So I'm going to click on the start button and then select WAMP Server 64 and wait for it to start up. Okay, so uh, WAMP should be up and running. So if I check the um, icon in the corner, so it's green, which means all the services are running. So I'm going to left click on the uh, WAMP icon and then scroll up to localhost, click that option and wait for this to load. Okay, and I'm on the uh, WAMP server page. So what you want to do is select the PHP info link under tools and I'm on the PHP info and that will tell me the current version of PHP that I'm on. So I'm currently on PHP 8.3. So at the time of um, recording this, the current version of PHP is 8.4. Um, but this version of um, WAMP that I've installed actually does come with 8.4. So I can actually switch to it. So I'm going to show you how to switch to um, from version 8.3 to 8.4. So if I minimize this, go back to the uh, WAMP icon in the corner, left click, and I'm going to hover up over to PHP and that'll show another menu. And then go into that menu, select version at the top, and you can see all the uh, versions of PHP that are available in WAMP. And you can see that 8.4 is available. So I'm going to left click that and you need to wait um, for a few moments for a WAMP to update. So there should be a pop-up. There we go. And you can also tell um, by the color. So green means that um, all services are running. So if I go back to the browser, refresh this uh, PHP info page, and you can see that I'm on actually on PHP 8.4 now. So the next thing that I want to do is add in a new version of PHP because um, let's say PHP 8.5 has been released. Um, you may want to add that to WAMP or if there's like a version of PHP that isn't added to WAMP already that you want to add in. So if I go back to the list of versions, so left click this, go back to so we can see all the versions. So let's say you want to add in PHP uh, version 7.3, which isn't in this list. So what? how do we um, add in all these extra versions of PHP that are available? So you can do that by going to the WAMP server add-on site. So if I just grab the link from um, Notepad. So this URL, um, I'll include in the description so it's available for you in the for this video. So go back to the browser, open a new tab, go to this website, wampserver.aviatechno.net. And if you scroll down, there'll be a section with PHP versions. And you can see there's um, more PHP versions available that uh, than there are that's included WAMP already. So let's just say I want um, PHP 7.3 so I can just click this link here and that's going to download the um, installer to add in PHP 7.3 so once that's downloaded if I go to the downloads folder minimize this browser minimize that and if I double click on the um, downloaded file and this will install add the uh, new version to WAMP so double click that. So English as before, okay. So yeah, I'm already, this just tells you about that you need the um, visual C++ packages, but they've already been set up because we're running ramp. So this is fine, next. And now you can start the um, install for this new version of uh, PHP. So click the install button. Okay, and that's been um, added. So, Wait until, okay, so yeah, this just tells you how to switch the uh, version of PHP.
which we'll do in a moment. So click the next button to continue. Okay, and click finish, and there we go. So that new version of PHP should be added. So if I go back to the uh, WAMP icon, oh, okay, so I think the uh, install actually closes uh, WAMP, so I need to start up WAMP again. So if I go to WAMP Server 68 for it to start up. Okay, it's ready. So I'll left click on the icon, scroll up to PHP, version and you can see the uh, new version is available to select now so 7.3 so i'm going to left click on that to update it to that version so wait for um, WAMP to uh, restart and apply the change okay check the icon to see if it's green yep so that should be done so i'm going to left click go back to localhost again Go back to PHP info, and there we go. We've got the new, we've uh, switched to um, PHP 7.3, and we're able to use that um, for our PHP development. So, hope this video has been helpful to you. Leave a comment below if you have any queries or issues, and thank you for watching.